Welcome. Today I'm going to show you a quick start to create a design file that has text and it will be arranged on an arc. We're going to start under the system tab under the file section, the blank design. This will create a new work area. We're going to use this icon called create sections. This is going to open up a tab for path. Under insert we're going to create add text. Simply click on it. This will bring up our lettering tab. We're going to use the default digitized font Tango under one half inch. If you choose to change the size of your font, make sure that you press enter before going to your text box. We're going to be using an art lettering and then we're going to come here to arrange if you click on the down arrow, you're going to see your defaults and your templates that your lettering can be uh, placed within. Upper arc, and hit enter to bring it in your screen. Your lettering is in a selection box, and by clicking and dragging the gray nodes, you can manipulate your text. You can stretch it out. Pull it in. You can actually bring it on the circle. You have to decide how you like your lettering. Within the lettering box, each character has a, some manipulation areas. You can enlarge your letters. You can move them up or move them down or move them on the baseline. Once you're happy with how your lettering is looking, you simply can right click and go accept OK, press enter on the keyboard, or generate. This will generate your text and you'll see the color generation clicking outside of the box you see your um, stitches by clicking on the 3D generation. You can see your simulation view. And that's how you make a lettering on an arc. Don't forget, you can change your actual uh, densities, different characters, different colors for your lettering under your object manager, or you can select your entire text and do global changes under stitch type. Hope this helps. Thank you.